now I welcome you to the segment I like to call questions and answers. The first question comes to us from Giovanni in New York. The home I'm trying to sell is now vacant and empty. Can it sell this way or should I furnish it? In the end, this is up to the seller. But as an agent, I will say that an empty room will always look smaller and will not make the buyers imagine what this property will look like with their furniture. Few furnishings will go a long way. You will also want to cleverly place them in each room and use neutral colors that will make the rooms look larger. Not everybody has an extra set of furniture for staging. Therefore, you might think of renting furniture for a couple of months. Many of the most successful home stagers do it and will make your home stand out from other homes in your neighborhood, which may not be arranged in the way yours is. Remember, your goal is to sell the home and this is just another way of getting there quicker than others. The second question comes to us from Trisha in Houston. What are the advantages of choosing a real estate agent over selling it myself? Well, Trisha, I don't want to sound biased. Therefore, the best way to answer this to you is by giving you a list of what a real estate agent is responsible for when selling a home. And at the end, you make your own decision. As an agent, I'm very familiar with the issues many homeowners face when they try to sell their home on their own. And the best way for you to understand them is putting yourself in their shoes. What would you do if you were looking for a house to buy right now? To begin, buyers will offer much less because they know you're saving the commission by selling the property on your own. You will also have a great deal of out-of-pocket expenses such as advertising, marketing, and legal services. Another big issue if you have children or elderly in your home is security because you will find yourself having to allow strangers into your home at any time. And of course, if you're not an experienced negotiator, you may literally be giving away more at the bargaining table than you would have paying commissions with an experienced sales associate. There are percentages that will show you this.